Hi, welcome back to Informatica tutorial. In the last uh, class, we have seen uh, router transformation. So uh, let's say we have we have given three uh, groups. We have created three groups in the router for three salary ranges. So uh, in in router, we have given uh, this is a router transformation, and we have uh, we can create uh, n number of groups here. So last time uh, and default is always present so default group is always present and uh, we can create uh, one two n number of groups here so last time we created one two three groups for uh, low salary and medium salary and high salary now uh, and nothing went into default group even though we connected uh, the output of the default group to a flat file uh, it got 0 KB file got created so because we have given a low as less than 5000 salary this has 5 to 10 K and this has a greater than 10 K so we have covered all the ranges so nothing went to default group so now let's do one small modification we will say here instead of 5 to 10k instead of 5 to 9k so there is a gap between 9k and 10k that will come into the default group so let's see uh, how that works uh, in informatica so i'm opening our router transformation which we have created in the last session and I am simply uh, changing the condition for one of the groups which is the medium salary I am saying it is less than 9000 so let's see what is going to happen and I will go to the workflow refresh uh, the mapping and saving it again and then running this task again so this time all the files should get overwritten with this new conditions so we can see eight records went into the default group 19 with high salary high salary we did not change it is all earlier also it was greater than or equal to 10,000 now also it's the same low salary also we didn't change we only touched the medium uh, salary uh, we reduced uh, from 10k to 9k the upper end of the medium salary so the remaining eight records went into the default group so let's see whether that is correct or not so suppose if I run a query which is less less than 9000 here it should give me 31 records yeah it gave me 31 records so remaining 8 records between 9k and 10k went into the default group so now the default group has data and it's only eight records and all the records are nine greater than or equal to nine thousand and less than ten thousand salary so that is uh, the use of a default group in the router in the next class we will see some more transformations thank you